Francesca, doing things differently. And today I have for you guys a Shein purse haul. Yeah, I'm so, so happy about these purses. So we have a little bit of a variety here. I tried to kind of like mix it up a little bit, you know, just because we need some variety in our life. You know, you know what I'm saying? You know, you know? Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and do the shout out of the week. And today's shout out goes to Brownie B. Thank you so much for commenting. I appreciate each and every one of you guys for commenting. It definitely does help me. Plus, I love interacting with you guys. I like, I like talking about stuff with you guys. I, I just like it. It's just something I like to do. If this is the first time you guys are joining me here on my channel, please make sure that you subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell for notifications so that you'll be alerted every time I upload a video, which is usually just once a week, sometimes twice a week. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this video. Ready? Let's go. Let's just go ahead and grab out the first one. Here's the first item here. And, hmm, it <laughs> doesn't look like how I remember. It looks much flimsier and mm, not the best quality either. But it is so much smaller like I like them to be. So this is how it goes. Here's the little, um, little strap and it goes right in kind of like a belt almost. And then that kind of secures it closed. And then when we open it up, it also has a zipper that you can do. So you have that extra security, not just that little strap thing. If you look in here, there is no extra pockets or anything like that. And then we just have the regular strap right here. Now, again, I have said this in previous videos, but just in case you missed it, if you ever get a brand new purse or belt or anything with a strap like this, and see how it's like all curved and, and scrunched from being in this purse. Good way to fix that is put, putting it in the dryer. You're gonna put it in with a damp towel, uh, not a big towel, maybe like a hand towel or even a washcloth would really work. And you wanna put it on high heat. And you're just gonna tumble it around for maybe five, 10 minutes at the most. And then this is not gonna be that like wrinkled, creased mess. It's, it's also not gonna be so stiff. You know how like when you first get it, everything is super stiff? That's gonna take care of this. But I will say, which is somewhat common sense, but just in case, because I did it to myself, um, when I took it out, I didn't take into consideration that the metal was going to be hot and I burned myself. So just a little fair warning to you, be careful because you don't think of that kind of stuff sometimes, or at least I did it. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at what this looks like with stuff in it and on. quality of purses I'm not gonna lie uh, it's a very thin material but it does hold quite a bit of things and it's like that perfect if you just need to go run somewhere and you got to throw a few things in a purse that's the perfect purse for that let's see what our next item is all right moving on we have this guy this is a little tan purse and it has the little handle oh, so cute so we have the little handle and then we have like a little bit of design on here we have this little knob that you twist i believe yes you twist it and then it just opens up. we have a, a scarfy and then a strap and that's going to go around here so let me put this together and show you what it looks like all right so here we go so you have the little um scarf that can go around this little handle here you can put it in a bow you can just put it in a knot you can also wrap it around this here and just make it kind of like hang or you can actually just take it completely off and not use it at all. Completely up to you, however you want to do it. But this is what it looks when like. You open it up. You see right here, we just put the straps through and then we put a little knot there so that it won't come out. When you open it up in the middle, again, there are no sections, no um, dividers, no anything like that. This, again, as you can see, is super thin. Um, it's not... Again, not the, like the best quality, but absolutely not the worst quality. It does have some loose threads I'm seeing so here. So if you guys can see, like right here, we have some inside. We have some loose threads right there as well. So again, not the best quality, but definitely not the worst quality. Let's go ahead and get this on and see what it looks like holding it.
again was it was a little bit thinner but i think it was better than quality than the first one that we saw um i love the color of it the scarf i'm not like 100 percent sure if i love it on the purse however i can use it for other things so it's kind of like a win-win um but i do like it i think it's very nice all right item number three is this guy here so this one is it almost looks like a makeup bag, but let's unzip it because we probably have a strap in there. Here is the strap. Let me go ahead and put it on and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, we got it um, all fixed up. So this is definitely one that can benefit from going in the dryer because it is a little bit dented in here on the sides and we need to um, kind of make the fabric a little bit more workable, if you will. Um, and then it does have the chain belt, which as you guys all know, I don't love the chain belt, but in this case, I don't necessarily mind it, right? So normally the reason I don't like it is because it's very cold against your skin and it always gets my hair. Never fails, constantly it will pull my hair. So this one though doesn't really seem like the type of chain that does that, there are certain types, but here is the chain. I don't like love gold, but I don't hate gold. Every once in a while, I do need a purse that's gonna go with some gold accessories. So that's why I did get this knowing that it was gold but the inside again just like the rest of them there is no pockets there's no little compartments nothing like that so let's go ahead and see what this <laughs> my cat is killing me here guys Yeah, that one I like. I don't really mind that chain at all. I mean, it's still really cold against my skin, but it's also coming to be winter and that's not gonna really matter. It's only more so in the summer when it touches your skin, you're like, oof, you know, but usually in the winter you have long sleeves on or at least short sleeves on, so you won't feel it up against like your body so much, but love it. Let's go ahead and see item number four. Here is this one here. We have this little design here. We have the same quilted type, um, pattern on it and then we have the little zipper here the strap and then again inside we have nothing um no compartments nothing like that and i pretty much love everything about these sort of bags I, they're just my favorite kind um the holes to put the strings in are right here on the sides so you just kind of shove it in like that and then you tie a knot on it so that it doesn't come out the quality on this is actually pretty good it, this one feels the most thick than any of the other ones. It feels more well-made, if you will. So let's go ahead and see what this one looks like on. I like that one a lot. I really wish that they would take some time and just make a better strap. You know, you don't want a crappy strap when you've got a really nice purse. I just don't get it. But let's go ahead and see item number five. Item number five is this little guy. Now, what you would use this for and what you would carry in it, I don't know. Other than lip gloss and maybe some money and a card, nothing is going to fit in here. But... I couldn't resist, it was so cute. You know, I've always wanted a little mini purse like this, even if it's just to take pictures in. You know, here it is, very small and tiny. Has a little snapperoo on it, you just go boop. And then we open her up and it has the little stuffing in it. And then we have the chain. Here she is, look how tiny. It's like it's like wearing your a wallet as a purse. That's what this looks like. So it has a very long chain strap, you open her up and then you just have that little itty bitty room. Let me go ahead and see what can fit in here and I'll show you guys what I can So fit. I got my Cedar Point Pass. See if it'll fit in here. No, it's too small and it doesn't fit long ways either. Well, I could shove it in there, but then it kind of like goes crooked a little. So that's not and gonna we work. have this, which I carry medicine in. Um, I can carry gum in it. So I can carry my contacts in it. I can carry jewelry in it. It doesn't really matter whatever you want to carry in it, but 
um, it's just a little contact case that I use for a carrying case. So let's see if that fits. Boop, it does, yay. Let's go ahead and see what this looks like on. Oh my gosh, tell me that wasn't the cutest little thing. And I'm pretty sure that I got it in two colors. All right, let's go ahead and see purse number six. This is a um, fanny pack type purse. I believe all the fanny packs I have, I do not have it in brown. So of course I needed a brown one. So this one is kind of different though because it has a little chain, which is awesome, very cute. And I have a little pocket there, but wait, there's more. <laughs> You have a hidden pocket in the back that's actually the bigger pocket, I believe, out of the two. So you can kind of have your important stuff right here. And then the stuff that like your chapstick, lip gloss, um, chargers, anything like that, you can kind of hold in the front. And then maybe your ID, money, wallet, anything like that you can hold in the back. Very cute, very cute. Let me go ahead and adjust it. So I think this is the kind that you put around your body it's not one that you put around your waist so you kind of have to wear it like this but this is really cute that you can wear it like that or you can wear it I don't know why I just took it off to do that I could just turn it around but or you could wear it like this in the back but yeah I would always wear it like this in the front and I would tighten it up a little bit and kind of make it go like this but I think this is super cute I really like this one a lot and the quality on this one is actually pretty good. A little added detail with the little chain on it is awesome. Very cute, nice little detail. Yeah, yeah, all right. Well, I really like this one. We're not gonna do a try on because we already did it right there. This is A plus. This is my favorite so far. So let's see what item number seven is. So here's the other little one. It's a little white one. I saw the blue one and I was like, oh, I don't have any, any blue. You know, I might as well get blue even though I never wear blue like that. Um, but I figured I could wear it with like an all black outfit or something like that. And then we have a little white one. So I could wear it with like an outfit like I have on now. Just cute. Something if I just need to take something and go. And the good thing about these is, is because of these, they have these little whole, these little, um, parts right here. You can put on a different strap if you want. Like you don't have to use the strap that it comes with. If you have other straps to other purses that might look better, you know, no, use that one. Obviously, this is the same as blue one, so I'm not going to open it and show you guys, but very cute. Very excited. That'll do it, you guys. That'll wrap up this video. I will be having the uh, TikTok Maybe Buy It Part 2 video coming soon. I am waiting on one more thing I didn't realize, just so that you guys know. If you, again, are a first-timer, my name is Jessica. I do mostly reviews on my channel, but every once in a while, I might do a vlog, or I might do a DIY, or I might do something else, you know, sporadic, but for the most part, just reviews. So if you like what you've seen, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell for notifications for every time I upload another video so that you don't miss out. And Go ahead and comment down below any video ideas that you might have and share this video. Share with a friend, a neighbor, a cousin, a sister, a brother. Share with whoever you want, but share it. All right, you guys, until next time, I'll see you later. Bye!